Charges have been filed against a woman accused of dumping 25 bags of animal remains in the Washington County desert last fall. The remains come from a pet cremation business in Las Vegas. Reporter Isabella Martin with our partner station KTNV in Las Vegas has been following this story. In October, we traveled to Utah to speak with Sergeant Lucas Alfred with the Washington County Sheriff's Department. This was after they made the first discovery. It is a current investigation. It's, it's still ongoing. Our deputies looking into where they possibly originated from, who left them out there. We're trying to find that chain of custody from those animals that ended up with them in Central. Over the course of our reporting, members across our Valley community reached out to Channel 13. I very, I'm just very angry. I don't know where she is she could still be in his freezer. And I wish he would just tell people he, he can't get it done. Adrian Cheng has been waiting to receive her 16 year old dog Haley's remains since September of last year. And I want to take care of her properly the way she deserved to be taken care of. Rick Seninger, owner of First Call Pet Cremation, told us back in December Chang would be hearing an update on her dog's remains. Still, the Changs have received no word. She deserves more than being left in a freezer or dumped in the middle of the desert. So, uh, and I, I hope other families um, will have better luck if they fall into his horrible situation. Now, there are at least some answers pertaining to who dumped the animal's remains in Utah. Since that time, our investigation has concluded. Sergeant Alfred says charges have been filed against a woman by the name of Mackenzie Fry. Officials say she was working with the owner of First Call Pet Cremation and had been contracted to cremate the animals. But instead, they say she dumped the remains in the Utah desert. We were able to charge one individual in our county with basically littering, nuisance charges, and operating without a business license. So all of our evidence is pointing to the fact that uh, first call pet cremation was transporting animals and delivering them to Mackenzie Fry, where they contracted to have her complete the cremation. And then she was sending the remains back via a delivery person. Sergeant Alfred said when it comes to first call owner Rick Seninger. Unfortunately, we have no charges pending for him. He hasn't done any activity in our county. We reached out to Mackenzie Fry for comment on her pending charges and received no response. Channel 13 also reached out to Seninger for comment on Fry's charges. He said in part, quote, once we became aware of the actions taken by the crematory operator, we stopped bringing in new families and actively assisted Utah law enforcement with consistent communication and information needed to take appropriate action. We are all victims of the actions of these individuals and feel terrible for the families who have been impacted. As for Adrian Chang's beloved Haley, Rick says, quote, now that the investigation is nearing completion and once we are assured that providing information to families will not adversely affect prosecution, we will contact families and provide a final resolution. This includes Haley's family.